What's up folks, I'm Tom from Jailbreak Nation, and in this video I'm going to be showing you three pretty awesome tweaks that I think you should have for your newly jailbroken device. Now since the jailbreak for iOS 5.1.1 recently came out, I thought I'd do this as something new for you, just to kind of give you an overview of some awesome tweaks you should pick up. I would also just like to mention that if you like this video, you can subscribe to my channel via the link on your screen right now and in the description if you want to see more of my coverage. I do jailbreak tweaks a lot, videos and stuff like that, all things to do with tech over on my channel. The first tweak is iPad specific and it's called Mountain Lion Center. Now this actually only just came out and basically it lets you slide in Notification Center from the right side of your screen, much like it does in, uh, or it's supposed to, in OS X 10.8 Mountain Lion. So as you can see, it works really, really well in or out of apps and it even dims the home page if you do it on the springboard. The next tweak I'm gonna be showing you is called Dashboard X. Now this has really got some hype in the uh, last kind of couple of weeks or so. And also just to mention, I will be doing um, a post on Jailbreak Nation as well. So you can go and check that out for maybe some extra tweaks and stuff like that, which I'll include. So what this tweak does is it lets you put notification center widgets on your home screen. So as you can see here, I have notification center widgets purely devoted to on my springboard. So I've got NC settings there. I've also got jukebox. And as you can see, you can of course interact with the widgets. So I've got NC settings, as I said, so I can toggle uh, all of the toggles that work with that. Pretty much any notification center widget will work with Dashboard X. So it's a really, really cool tweak and one which definitely puts iOS above Android. And the final tweak I'm gonna show you is called Springtimize 2. And if you're into jailbreaking, you'll probably know about this tweak because it's pretty much the most in-depth tweak I've ever seen or anyone in the jailbreak scene has seen. That sounded weird. Um, so basically it just includes so many customization options, it's ridiculous. So for example, there's probably at least a hundred things you can customize using this tweak on its own that individually you'd need a hundred tweaks for. So as you can see, you get the ability to respring every single time uh, you'd make a change, but you can make changes, loads of changes at once and respring and they will all take effect. For, so for instance, you could change the animation speed um, of all the animations on your device and you could change the icon size for your home screen Just so much customization and one really awesome tweak So that's about it for this episode if you enjoyed it hit that like button Also subscribe to both iPod uplink and my channel using the link on your screen right now or the link in the description Also check out our article over on jailbreak nation for some extra tweaks that I haven't included in this video Thank you very much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one